Luke from CoreCarsNews.com. Today I'm testing out the Curve Amplified Antenna with a 50 mile range. Now I've already tested this, so I'm going to do a little unboxing here, and as I do so I'll talk about my experience with it. Um, the first thing I kind of noticed with this is the ease of opening it. Just a little flap, you flip it over and you have access to the box. It may seem like a simple thing, but I hate when manufacturers make it impossible to get the product out of the box, especially when you're doing a lot of these. So here's the antenna, it's got a black back, and a white front. It's got there's the curve as the name implies. It's designed to be used with a stand that's right over here. Um, it's both both of them are made out of high quality plastic, which is nice, very durable, and it's light. So if I'm putting this on top of a shelf, it's not a heavy design at all. You just kind of take the stand there, you snap it in at the top, you snap in these two bomb parts, and right there's the stand for it. And it will sit right up there behind your TV, on your shelf, very thin. And if you want, you can always flip it around for the black side. And then right back here, let me take the stand back off. Once you get the stand in, it can be a little difficult to get off. Probably should have showed this first. Here, I'll just go on the side here. Is the um, coaxial cable plug-in. You can take the included cable, let me grab that, and run it to the amplifier on your TV. Now it does come with a very nice cable, um, great length, uh, more than enough for a stand if you want to put it on a shelf on your TV stand or right next to the TV, this is all you'll need. Um, even if you want to run it to another side of the room, um, let's say you have a table somewhere else you want to put it on, this would be perfect for it too. Uh, right here is the amplifier. Um, same thing here, uh, great length. It's made to be plugged. You plug this into the TV, you plug this end from the cable coming from the antenna, and then the amplifier um, is a USB. Most TVs, smart TVs or HD TVs, I should say, have a USB port on it. Um, if it's available, I recommend plugging this in there uh, so that when the TV's not running, it's not drawing power. You can also just take a wall charger, plug it into the wall if your USB port is um, used. But the length of the cable on the USB charging part is great. Um, e very easy to reach to a plug um, next to your TV if you need to. So there's the antenna. Very simple to set up. Really not a lot of questions um, with it. It is a good size antenna, as you can see with my hand. But, it, it looks nice it's sitting there next to my TV. Um, here is, before I forget, here is the plug that you can use to plug into the wall. Right there's the USB port on it. Um, it is so simple. The instructions are about as basic as it comes. But they're very well written. So if you're new, a little concerned about how to set this up, have no fear. Um, it will explain everything from connecting the stand to setting up the um, connection to your TV and even how to program the channels on your TV so that you only have the channels that actually have content on it. Um, there also are deals included. Um, as you can see, it talks about $250 of bonus special offers inside. Uh, a lot of these are... Um, trial subscriptions and other great features. Right here's that little bonus. I'm sure, you know, depending on how long ago this video was posted, there'll be different ones. But you can see like Papa John's, you can get some um, discounts on pizza, on different items, uh, indie films, music content. So great little bonus right there, especially if you're already, I mean, if you eat pizza or you um, listen to Rhapsody music, it's just one more bonus to make it worth it. Uh, the reception I was very impressed with. I found it to be better than the Leaf. Um, I would put this between the Leaf and the Sky as far as quality of reception. Um, I don't know if it was just because it's um, you know just being on a stand on top of the TV, it got a little bit better reception than the Leaf hanging the wall. But we did get a couple extra channels with a lot less fuss on this. Um, and it's kind of a little bit more stylish. You know, if you just want something sitting next to your TV, 
this is probably one of the um, options you want to go. Kind of the old rabbit um, ear concept with those um, you would have on top of your TV back in the day. But a whole lot more stylish and better built. Um, one of the things I like about this over the rabbit ears for me personally is I have a two-year-old who pulls on everything with the TV. I'll be able, uh, I'm not very concerned with her pulling this down and breaking it. This is pretty robustly built. Um, good solid plastic on it that I looks like it could take quite a beating. Uh, rabbit ears, uh, my daughter would get in there and move them and lose the signal or drop them on the floor. I would rather deal with this. So this is a benefit um, that I'm going to be using in my own house and uh, been very impressed with. So I would give it a 10 out of 10. Uh, high quality, easy setup, um, great accessories with the long cables included, and that the built-in amplifier has a very long um, cable on it. Even down to the smallest things like the box that it came in. Being easy to open, easy to access, plus um, if you're unsure what you would get in there, uh, they have a great website at their gomohu.com. Uh, that's G O M O H U.com. I'll have a link to it in the comments where you can go in there and look at um, what you should receive. You can either scan this um, IR code right here and it will give you a link right to your cell phone browser to say, hey, here's my zip code, here's my address, what is there? Or you can go on your computer, type all, in all that information, and it'll say, hey, with each antenna, here's what stations you should expect to get. So from the pre-ordering um, process to make sure you get the right antenna, to the um, packaging, the quality, the ease of setup, 10 out of 10, very impressed with what they made. If you have any more questions or you'd like to find out um, other reviews that we've done, Check out CoreCutterSnews.com. I'll have a link to that. And thank you for watching this video.